The EEG Data Plot web application is a powerful tool for visualizing and analyzing EEG data. By combining the strengths of Flask and Plotly, it offers a seamless and interactive user experience. Whether you are a researcher, clinician, or student, this application provides an intuitive way to explore brain activity and gain insights from EEG recordings. We hope you find this tool useful for your EEG data analysis needs. I'm on the same it's not my voice. Well, it kind of is because I'm prompting this thing. But surely the robot voice is much nicer than my own. The data set that I'm reviewing here is real EEG. It's from a subject. Yeah, if we're talking about ethics, well, there's more pressing issues than just identifying or they identify subjects. In this case, their identity is really not an issue. The issue is who the subjects are. Let's put it this way. They are non-human. So there's a whole can of worms there that makes it easy in terms of uh, identification of, uh, you know, data privacy and the like. It's not a problem anymore, is it? And then there's more pressing ethical concerns about using animal subjects in research but the study was already done so the data is there we might as well use it i'm having a technical issue with this data is that there's too much loaded on the screen even though that data file is actually small yeah we need to essentially downsample and display it on the screen like that and we'll be looking at that next well, the good thing about it, it's not running on my server anymore. So when you actually go to this link, this will be running in your browser. So you will be paying for electricity or a change. Those are epileptic spikes, actual seizures. And yeah, normally with epilepsy, ECG is being recorded at the same time. So most data sets will also have at least one channel of ECG, if not more, included in the data set. And yes, you can identify a subject based on their, you know, if they have a mild heart condition, their subject could be identified. So yeah, the good thing about those, it's all synthetic data, so there's no ethical concerns. This one actually looks more, more realistic. It's still synthetic, there's just noise added to it. Uh, those actual ECG uh, waveforms, not from any living subject. But... Uh, Hopefully, if you are a clinician, do let me know if they look realistic to you or not. Because if not, we need to improve it.